So how far can you run an analog audio signal over a Cat5 shielded cable? Well, let's find out. We could put the radial catapult rack TX in one location and send 12 channels of audio to the catapult rack RX in another location using three Cat5 shielded cables. Alternatively, you could use any combination of catapult rack TX, rack RX, and catapult minis. So this is extremely powerful, but let's use these devices in an unconventional way to learn something. In this setup, I've connected bank A of each device with a 50 foot CAT6 shielded cable, bank B of each device with a 250 foot CAT6 shielded cable, and bank C of each device with 500 feet of CAT6 shielded cable. This should allow us to progressively listen to the impacts of cable length. We still don't hear any degradation of the signal at 200 feet. Let's try adding in bank B. 1200 feet is such a long distance, more than I've ever had to run audio. But let's keep going to see what happens to audio at extreme distances. We can see and hear some high frequency drop off, as well as an overall drop in signal level but not until the cable length is extremely long. 